let's talk about the NBA All-Star Game, all right? We got a little bit of a controversy, if you will. And if you checked out my trash talking on Deadspin today, you can look it up. It's on, on my social media as well. I trashed the idea that the NBA didn't figure it out so that Kyrie Irving shouldn't be on the All-Star ballot. And only from the standpoint that he will probably not play a game and he will probably, uh, I think, there'll be some sort of drive or movement from the people who are Kyrie supporters for the unvaccinated and all that. This will become, again, a political, not political, but it'll become like a movement that has nothing to do with basketball. It'll be about people who just don't want to follow the masses and try to get this vaccine behind us. They will just say, we don't want to be vaccinated and Kyrie's standing up for us. So we're going to vote for him to be on the all-star team. And I don't think it's right. I think the all-star team is supposed to be about the best players through the first half of that NBA season. And if Kyrie was playing more power to him, but I think there'll be somebody, an all-star, a guard, a point guard, you know, positions don't really matter, who won't be on that team because people will vote for Kyrie who hadn't played all year to play in the All-Star game. And it will become a spectacle. And the attention of the players who play in the league who are supposed to cherish that moment of an All-Star game will be turned into a political uh, pigskin. So that people can kick it around and say, ah, look at the NBA. They they wouldn't let Kyrie play. The people have spoken. They voted for Kyrie to start for the Eastern Conference. He's in the game. He hasn't played a minute all year. Is that what you want the All-Star game to be? No. It doesn't make it. You have to play. I don't see how you can be in the All-Star. Like It's one thing if you're debating not maybe 10 games or 15 games or enough to have played, right, to have played to qualify for the All-Star game. I don't think you should necessarily have, like, a game limit because, again, the All-Star game is for fans, right? So, like, if a guy like Giannis, for example, just happened to see him on TV, I wish him nothing but the best. But let's say, like, right now he gets hurt, and then two days before the All-Star game he's cleared to play and he can play in the All-Star game, then then the question is, does Milwaukee want him to play? But absolutely, I do. Like, as a fan of the game, I want to see him out there. But, like, you have to – like, again, we were talking about this with Aaron Rodgers. There has to be some consequences for your actions. And this is the consequence that Kyrie said, I'm good with. I don't want to play basketball if it means I have to get vaccinated. That, that means I don't want to play regular season basketball. I don't want to play basketball in Brooklyn. I don't want to play basketball in Indiana or Philadelphia or, or, or Los Angeles or any of the other road places I'd go play basketball in. And it's not going to be in the All-Star game either because those are the, that, those are just the rules. Like, I don't understand – what the what the question would be as to why he is on the why I don't even understand why he's on the ballot in the first place. Right. Well, because the only people and I, you know, I read the story. The only people who are are barred is if you're like suspended or you know what I mean. You have some sort of legal uh, legal issue, Martin. I mean, your name I get it, but this off. isn't exactly but, the 2020 midterms, else. Rob. This isn't exactly the 2020 midterms. Like, this is the all-star game, and well, especially when you think about how being voted for some of these things impacts people's contracts and super matches and so on. Like, he can't be on it. He can't be an all-star this year. It, it just this, this is what it says, that basically all players on the rosters were put on the ballot. Both the league and team sources indicated, this is from the New York Post, that because uh, Irving is uh, still on the Nets' official roster, sent home but not suspended, he won't be an exception, Uh, despite not having played a second for the Nets this year. And they say the league uh, isn't currently expected to take an unprecedented action to to stave off uh, the possibility, though this uh, this is unprecedented. You know what I mean? Like, like this could wind up where the NBA has egg on its face. Well, especially, too, because this is the type of thing that, I mean, in general, like, when you take away the reason why Kyrie's not playing, let's just say, like, literally he was like he was like Ben Simmons right now and it was taking a mental health break or whatever Ben Simmons is describing his break away from the Philadelphia 76ers. Neither one of those guys have played a minute all season, right? But – 
The thing about Ben Simmons is his stance is not going to be one that's going to be co-opted by all types of other people. Because couldn't you see an online movement to get Kyrie uh, elected uh, as an all-star starter from people that have no interest in the game whatsoever? Right. Like this is what I'm like, saying. The game is going to be hijacked. By people who don't care about the NBA. It just feels uh, like this is a great opportunity for the people who, when when the Milwaukee Bucks walk off the court after Jacob Blake is shot in in Wisconsin, who say, what about China? This is a great opportunity for everybody who has that what about China-ness in their soul about the NBA to be like, well, here you go. Here's some of your own medicine right back in your face. Or lack of medicine in your face. for for, (laughs) Let, let Let me say this. So if Irvin does get voted on, okay? Uh, if Kyrie does get on there, uh, people could go back to 1992 to find a similar situation. It's, va- it's vaguely similar. Okay, Magic Johnson was forced to retire due to HIV. Martin, that was that was 30 years ago Sunday. 30 years ago Sunday that he uh, announced that he had the uh, HIV. But uh, got voted into the All-Star game. And had 25 points, nine assists in that game to earn the MVP honors. I covered that game, that All Star game in Orlando in 1992. Magic, I do not look at it the same way as Kyrie Irving's situation. And currently, this is the way the league does it. Uh, fans constitute 50 percent of the All Star vote, and the other part is split by the media and the players. Let's bring in Rob G. Rob G. is on that side that believes that. Kyrie should be on the ballot, and do you think he should be an all-star even if he doesn't play a minute this season? If he gets voted in, then yeah. You know, because uh, contrary to what you know, people in the media might think, the all-star game is not for them. The all-star game is for the fans. The all-star game is supposed to be a showcase of your best talent. I, Kyrie, I agree with Kyrie that, but Irving he hasn't played is, at all. But that's not necessarily his fault because if he played in dc if he played in miami if he played in pick your other favorite city then he would be on the all-star team no it's not he his doesn't fault. play there it's but he not doesn't his, play i understand there. that but you 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 can't say well the reason why kyrie irving is not going to be an all-star is because he didn't get vaccinated but bradley beal who's in the exact same situation can be an all-star simply because he plays in a different home city but it's not that he's being penalized because he, he didn't get vaccinated. He's not playing. Okay, so do you want to be the person but, but he, who no, sets the precedent? No, he's not playing. That, who, that's my issue. But, is, that, but that's – Magic Johnson didn't play, so who cares? And that no. was uh, supposedly you, you think one you of think the it's hallmark similar? moments Ma- Magic in Johnson, history. Magic Johnson was one of the all-time great players who was forced out of the game because of, of, of serious illness. And when people decided that – he could play. It, there was like a feeling of, uh, of, of like, let's give Magic this kind of thing. Like, uh, uh, this, let's give him his flowers. So it, what it, you're right, saying is right. you want to bend years the ago. rules for Magic Johnson because you like him more. No, yes. no. Here, here's the difference. The people, it, this will be hijacked by non-basketball people. Everything That's is hijacked problem. by non-sports people. Not everything. Yes, no, it's not. anything that has any kind of political or social, you know, can be tied to it in any kind of way has been hijacked. What? Give me an example. Colin Mr. Kaepernick, uh, Colin Kaepernick kneeling for the anthem and saying "Black Lives Matter" got hijacked by a group that had nothing to do with him. Black Lives Matter, the group, had nothing to do with what Colin Kaepernick was kneeling for. No, but but the point is, I'm talking about you have a showcase game that will turn into a circus and take away the attention of the sport, of the league, by a guy who hadn't played all year. I think it's very awkward. It doesn't feel right. And, and that's the problem I have. And somebody will be left off who deserve, who played during the year. I think Magic, and, and Martin used the right term, he was forced out, and, and this was like an appreciation of Magic. But he wasn't Magic. forced out. He decided no, no, to he, retire. Well, but at that time... Bro, Thirty years ago, people didn't know. To say. Thirty years ago, he, he didn't know decide. that much about HIV. Nobody go let him play with HIV. So yes, yeah, okay, and people sure, maybe were dying he months to after getting it. Right. Like he might have been forced to retire, but it's kind of like the same. You know, he was either going to retire or not going to be like it, it was easy. For, I don't say easy. It, it was much better for him to retire 
optically than anything else, right? So, like, the NBA was like, all right, let's have this moment. And I'm not saying they're directly, uh, uh, they're one directly followed the other, but the NBA said one of our greats, one of our legends is right. not going to be able to play anymore. We can have this game, which overarchingly does not matter in the grand scheme of the standings or, Kyrie or everything. Didn't even but make you can, the top make, you can make players. that exact same argument and just do it in the context of... No, because Kyrie is not one of no, the greatest players one of, of the all time. Greatest no, player, no, Kyrie's one, not one of the greatest players of, of all time. One of the greatest players in our league today, one of our most marketable no, athletes no, no, in our league no. today, is eligible to play because he's in a different city that does not have the same vaccine mandate. That, but 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 this is this is where we all live in different places. Rob G, we live I in understand that. L.A. Our rules here were different than what they were doing in Florida and Texas. Those are the cards. Those are the people, right? Who 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 legislate and protect and decide what's going to be good for the our the people in 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 this area or whatever area you live in. So those are the ones you have to either live by. Or you move out of town, or you move somewhere else. To be fair, and also to be fair to the the rest of the league, the NBA in 2020 they said that they were going to make allowances for this type of COVID stuff. Like they, like the Toronto Raptors played a whole season in Florida because that wasn't happening in Canada with the COVID. So they made the allowances for COVID. They said 2021, that's over with. This just the rules. It's like saying James Harden should be an all star because he, you know, normally he would have gotten all these foul calls and he would have made all these free throws and he would have averaged 30 points. He's like, but he's not. He's not there. He's like he's just not shooting. Like Kyrie's not there. He's not playing. All right.